The Manhattan Monologue Slam is the only television competition of its kind. The Slam is hosted by the Galinsky Brothers and features two sets of theatrical action. First, the championship set, where eight talented undiscovered actors compete for the National Monologue Slam title. Please welcome our next Detective? Yeah, seven years in San Quentin, in the hole for three, McNeil before that. That place is full of dipshit crews looking to fuck up and get busted back. They're like their three squares and free HBO. You see me doing thrill seeker liquor store holdups with a born a loose tattoo on my chest? No, you do not. And I'm never going back. I do what I do best. I take scores. You do what you do best, trying to stop guys like me. Man. I don't know what the fuck a normal life is. What the fuck is that? Barbecues and ball games? That's your life? A man told me you want to make moves, don't keep anything in your life, you're not willing to walk out on it. 30 seconds flat if you feel the heat coming around the corner. So if you're chasing me, and you got to move when I move, how do you expect to keep, uh, a marriage? And don't assume I'm a monk neither. I got a woman. If she thinks I sell swimming pools, that fucking bitch. And if I spot you around the corner, I'll walk out on her just like that. Leave her flat. That's the discipline. Don't look so depressed, detective. We're sitting here like a couple of regular fellas. You do what you gotta do, and I do what I gotta do. But if it's between me and some poor bastard whose wife I might make into a widow, it's him that's going down, brother. Because that's what I have to be. Huh? Mailman? Nah, could've never been that. Fucking normal life. Really? What happens if you're on my way and you try to put me away? What if you got me boxed in and I gotta put you down? Because no matter what, you will not get in my way. Now that we've been face to face, I would not feel so good about that. But I won't hesitate. Not for one second. You know, maybe it'll go down like that or uh, who knows. Maybe we'll never see each other again. Now get me a fucking soda, you pig. <laughs> Ron Bronstein doing a piece from the movie Heat, written by Michael Mann.